belittle other people to make themselves superior. So the narcissists, they make themselves more important than others by belittling others. They have difficulty managing their emotions and behavior. It, they find it very tough. Narcissists have a big challenge dealing with stress. They also have a big challenge when it comes to adapting to change. Narcissists, they avoid any situation in which they might fail because they love winning. With a narcissist, they must win. They easily, they, they, they frequently feel depressed and moody because they fall short of perfection. They always want to be perfect. Because they can't be, if they're not perfect, they always, they, they'll appear depressed and moody. Narcissists have secret feelings of insecurity. They have this fear of being exposed as a failure. Because within them, they know that they are, they are big failures. And they hate to be identified as failures. Now, if you're watching this live stream, what do you think, which trait do you think I've left out about this narcissist? Which is the other common trait about narcissist, narcissism or narcissism that I've left out? Because we know narcissists are generally people who love to be at the center of attention. They love making themselves the center of attention. If you're having a conversation with a narcissist, you realize that the topic, the discussion will revolve around them. A narcissist has this sense of self-importance. They have this preoccupation with power, beauty, or success. They are entitled creatures. They can only be around people who are important or special. They love exploiting others for their own gain. In short, they use and misuse others. They are very arrogant. They, are, they lack empathy. And to the narcissist, they must be admired. They need constant admiration. And they are envious of others. And they believe that others are envious of them. So these narcissists, the people who think narcissists are demons, they think these narcissists are evil creatures, evil spirits. The Jezebel spirit. Because we know narcissists are master manipulators. They have this grandiose sense of self-importance. Narcissists live in fantasy world that supports their delusion of being more important than others. They need constant praise, constant admiration. They have this sense of entitlement. They exploit others without guilt or shame. They're not embarrassed. They'll frequently demean, intimidate, bully, or belittle other people. So, the big question in this life is this. Are you a narcissist? Do you think you might be a narcissist? Do you think your partner might be a narcissist? Do you think you have a narcissistic relative, a parent, a sibling? Do you think where you work, you have a boss who's a narcissist? Do you have a narcissistic neighbor? What are the other signs of a narcissist that I've not mentioned? Thank you for watching this live stream. Please be free to, to click that like button if you like the live stream. And uh, let's meet here tomorrow for another live discussion about narcissism and what narcissistic personality disorder is. You see, knowledge is always power. The more we discuss narcissism, the more we understand it. And that's the first stage when dealing with a narcissist. It is knowing who a narcissist is. Thank you. See you tomorrow in the next live.